Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Marashka with Heaven's Darkness Guild. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to set up Healbot today because uh, it's been requested of me. Uh, sorry for the lag. It's okay. I don't think it should affect the video that much. Okay, first of all, you got to make sure it's on. Uh, <laughs> that is the most important thing. And right now, for this character, it is not. So, I'm going to go to Anakuri, which is my healer. There we go. Heal bot is on. Good. Okay. Make sure it's on. And then go ahead and log in. If I get a flood of whispers or something, I, I apologize for that. But I'm going to ignore them for now. La la la. Slow loading screen. La la la. Okay. Here we go. First of all, you're going to notice a new box. I'm going to move over here away from everyone else. Okay. You're going to notice a new box on your screen right here. Okay, and though mine's set up, I'm still going to go through the setup process with you. If you do not notice a box that looks like this, okay, then what you need to do is you need to click on the new H that is up, uh, up on your Titan panel or whatever you may use. I use the mini map. Okay, so you click and bring it up. Okay, make sure that you have the show mini map button on. If you don't, I don't know how you would bring up this menu. Okay, enable enable lib quick quick health. Um, okay, here's what you're gonna do. Make sure that healbot isn't disabled because that could be one of the reasons why healbot isn't up. Now, this part this part's pretty good. I keep mine set at 0.4 seconds. Okay, that means every 0.4 seconds it checks. Now you can take it down to every 0.05 seconds. But see, the thing is, is you're gonna, is, is you might lag. 0.4 seconds is about what you need. Okay, now you go to your spells. Now, since I'm configuring for Holy Pally, um, this may change for you, but this is this is how it's gonna work for me. Okay, so you'll notice that you have set sp uh, spells for enabled bars at all times. You want that. Now, left click button. Okay, that's the one on the left of your mouse. You want your most commonly used heal there. For Holy Pally, it is Holy Light. That's going to be your, you know, auto use one. Now you'll see that there is um there is an auto trinket button here. That means if you have a trinket that can blow a cooldown, like uh you get X spell power whenever you cast a spell it's reduced, anything like that you can auto trinket it by clicking these two buttons you can click them both okay but i have neither that can use it and yes i know i'm using lunar dust i haven't found a better one yet okay now if i would learn how to hit buttons okay now okay you want to have a shift click option i use cleanse for mine because because you want to be able to cleanse rather quickly, and shift click is the easiest way I've found to do that. And, you know, you can hit it with your pinky no matter what side you use. You lefties could use your right pinky. I don't know how you configure your bars. Now, you go to your right button. Okay, this is going to be like your big heal. This is going to be a little more important of a heal. Um, this is... Personally, I mean, I use on my Discipline Priest, Renew is my right button, uh, Shield is my left. It, it all depends on your play style. Okay, so Divine Light, which is the big one down here, it's 21,000, you know, it's, it's pretty good. You want to put that on your right button. So now, what you've got, do you even have a list, okay? If you see... Uh, left holy light, middle holy shock. I'll get there. Right divine light. Okay. Ignore the 35 mana. That doesn't matter. But watch. You simply click. Here, I'll move this. Okay. You left click holy light. You right click divine light. Okay. And that's how that works. Now, you go to. Now, for your shift click, for me, um, I don't have any holy power in light right now. Let me get some. Okay, for shift click, I use Word of Glory, which is your an instant cast heal. That's just what I use. You don't have to. Whatever you want your shift click to be there, go ahead and make that so. 
Now for your middle click button, I have Holy Shock. We use Holy Shock as much as we can, and the middle click button's a really good option for that. Sorry. So the middle click button's a really good option for that. Bam, Holy Light. Okay, and then once it's on cooldown, bam, Holy Light. You know, you can just keep hitting it, and that is one of our main heals. Um, also for a middle click, I have the expensive fast spell. Um, that's one of the things that I hated about, about Kata, is that they, they made these expensive fast spells. Now, I have that set up on my disc priest the same way. So the shift middle click is your expensive fast spell, flash of light. Heals for 14k, uh, and it takes like zero cast time, so it's really good. Now... One of the other cool things about Healbot, besides being able to set up your heals, now, let me show you this, let's pick this guy. Okay, you'll see that if I'm in a party, you don't have to be, because you can auto-add target. Okay, if if you're in a party, you, you have your options, and so let's say he's taking damage, Holy Light on him, Divine Light on Anna. Oh, Cheat needs a heal, there we go. Okay, that's how Healbot quintessentially works. Now as far as skins, um, I use uh, the standard skin. Okay, none, I, I, blah, blah, blah. Disable bar when range over 100 yards. That means if the dude is 100 yards away from me, his bar will disappear. And that's because if he's 100 yards away from me, I'm not running to heal his ass. He deserves to die. Okay. Now, cures. I'll tell you what, one thing that Healbot doesn't do well is cure. That's why I have my spell, my left uh, my left shift click, it's cleanse. Because Healbot's not very good for curing. You'd want something like um, decursive. Um, now, for buffs, as a holy pally, you want concentration or up. You want seal of insight up. That's this one right here. Your melee chance attacks have a chance to heal you and regenerate mana. Uh, Blessing of Kings. I use Kings because it gives you more intel. Um, that is an old way of thinking I should be using Might. I know that because 326 mana is better than 5% intel because they fucked you over as far as heals. Or as far as keeping mana up and so it's pretty bad. Now, um, tips, show tips, show target information, show my buffs. Now I have that like available, like let's say I'm going to go buff Cheat, who's still standing here for some reason. I don't know what the hell he's doing. Okay, you can buff him up. Uh, in a party, it'll show what buffs you have on. Um, and then other, you come over here, and this is your test bars, right? I'll show you what these look like. You don't really have to do that, okay? So, this is what it would look like in a party. Your names, how much health they have, etc., etc. Um, let me let me shut this off. There we go. Okay, and that is pretty much how you set up Healbot. Now, um, whenever you're in a party, it changes only slightly. A raid, it gets bigger. Um, like and. That's pretty much it. You can set up Healbot. It works very well, I assure you. Okay, um, it lets you... Uh, it, it really lets you not have to use the F1 keys, which... Um, the F1 keys, to me, they, they take a, away a lot of reaction time. A lot of people don't always agree with that. And then also, you know, clicking and then healing and then like, oh, someone's taking damage over there, I'll click on them. Healbot removes a lot of that. And um, it's pretty good. Pretty good add-on, I would say. Um, I'll set it up on my priest, too, I mean, if you want me to. But basically, whatever spells you prefer to use. Now, with Light of Dawn, since I consider that a cooldown, I don't actually have that Healbotted. So, like, we'll get some holy power and then I would rather click that one so I know what's going on you can also uh, set it so it blows cooldowns if you click a certain button and uh, again I feel like cooldowns are something you should know you notice that I have these all macro to my mouse and that I didn't show you like uh, click on mouse button 14 for this to happen it's because um, 
I don't think that's very fair, and if I'm ever on a computer playing WoW and I don't have a 14-button mouse, it's not going to work. So, like, Spirit of the Ancient Kings, you know, these are, these to me are cooldowns that you should, um, you know, you should save and, and click rather than just blow by hitting a button. You need to consciously think about them. Um, I also don't have Holy Radiance, um, put on there because, again, Holy Radiance is something that I feel that you should have to click on. Um, other than that, uh, thank you all for your time, and I hope I, I showed you how to use Healbot a little bit, so, uh, enjoy.